Debo Samuel is absolutely done with your questions about the Philadelphia Eagles and the NFC Championship game. Zach Gelb of CBS Sports found this out the hard way as he persisted to pepper Debo Samuel with questions about the NFC Championship game and the Philadelphia Eagles. Debo Samuel clearly is done talking about it, so much so that he walked off this interview on CBS Sports. Take a listen to Debo Samuel's reaction to the continuous questions about the Eagles. Devo Samuel here with us. Well, something that is your call. I saw what you said about the Eagles back at the Super Bowl at Sirius, where if Brock Purdy didn't get hurt, you guys would have won that game by double digits. Why, why would that have been the case? I don't know that, though. So do you not still believe that? I mean, I do. But, I mean, we, we're not – that shit is like – we're not going to keep talking about it. I mean, I said what I said. Gotcha. So then what happens this year when you play Philly on December 3rd? I don't know. Just wait till what, week 13, 12, whatever week it is, and we'll show you. Well, then you know how that's going to go I down. Have, you're, you're going into Philadelphia. Have, Those fans are going to be booing you loud. you have a message for Eagles fans? Hey, guys. Yeah? All right, we're good to go. What do you mean? We have Debo on right now. Yeah, I know, but we're going to head into camp right now. Are, are you serious? Okay. Thank you. That's There you Thanks, go. Bye. Debo Samuel right there doesn't want to answer a few questions. Are uh, you serious? We got hung up on because <laughs> all we did was ask him about the quarterback situation and then Philadelphia, and we got hung up on by Devo Samuel? That's a joke. An absolute joke. That's absurd. We were told we had 15 minutes with him. He was on for five, six minutes, and he didn't want to answer anything. So I've done this long enough. That was just get the promotional plug out of the way. Then you don't want to answer any questions, and you hand the phone off to the public relations person. What a joke that was. It is the Zach Gelb Show on CBS Sports Radio. We'll we'll come on back. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of reaction to that one. But what a joke that was. That was just a hit and run, get the plug in, don't want to answer anything. And then Debo goes off and probably going to do about six or seven more of those interviews. What do you think about this particular situation? Do you think the interviewer should ask better questions and move on from a topic that has been well discussed and clearly feels like he's fishing for clicks or a headline to be able to go viral as it has gone before from previous interviews? Or do you think Debo Samuel should have just given a PC answer and moved on with the interview? Do you think he should have stayed on or is walking off appropriate? Clearly, you could sense from Debo Samuel that he was done with asking and answering these questions. And Debo Samuel knows what this game is. He understands that these particular questions are asked to be able to get quotable and newsworthy comments that could go viral and ultimately help CBS and their brand and actually hurt Debo as a result. So clearly, Debo Samuel wasn't having it, and he walked off as a result.